Everywhere I go on social media, no one can see enemies in Cold War. They're just not there. They're invisible. Well, I got a fix for you guys. What is going on, guys? It's the Champ Strider here. And I know that everyone is just having a terrible time seeing enemies in, uh, in Black Ops Cold War. And I also had some problems in beta where you just had to kind of wait to see movement because the people blend into the background so, so good. So now that the game released, I'm super excited because that means NVIDIA filters are in, which means we have the, the option to kind of try to fix the visibility ourselves. I put together some settings for you guys that, uh, that I think are going to help. So let's check them out. So this will only work for PC players and I have my brightness in game set to 70%. Uh, things will vary a little bit depending on your monitor. So you can put some tweaks and see what's kind of what's good for you as far as the settings go. But the first thing we're going to do is hit Alt Z. All right. And this is going to bring up our uh, our NVIDIA game filter and we're going to click the bottom tab. This is game filter. And then we're going to go. We have all these presets. I already have one done. And it's going to turn from this, the base game, to this, which, look, it's a lot more vibrant. It's a lot easier to see. It's a bit sharper. So let's go over which settings we're going to do. So uh, I already put the filters up here, but you're going to click the Add Filter option. A big box will come up where you can select what you need, and it's going to be the Color tab, the Brightness Contrast tab, and the sharpen tab. So when you go to the color settings, this is what the default settings will be. I like the little bit of tint to the game. I think it brings some life, but let's just pull the intensity down to say like 15% and it looks a little bit cleaner and more natural. And then we're going to go down to this vibrant slider over here and we're going to pull this up to around 70% and this is going to bring out the uh, the contrast so you can kind of see the difference between colors by uh, by quite a bit. So next up for brightness contrast, we are going to pull the contrast down to about, let's say around 20%. And then we are going to pull the highlights down to zero. And then this is the important thing. We're going to leave the shadows at minus 30% to pull out some of those dark shadows in the game. And the last thing you're going to hit is the sharpening tab. And uh, this is the big slider right here. This game's a little bit grainy out of the box. So you want to get rid of all that film grain, pull it up to 100. And then I pull my sharpening up to 65. This will make everything seem a little bit more high res, a little clearer. Um, I'm older than probably most of you guys, so so my old eyes need the extra sharpening. So this is a good place for you guys to start. I know everybody's monitor is a little bit different, so uh, you might need to tweak the settings a little bit, but it'll change it, as I said, from this to this, which just looks so much better and it's so much easier to see people. Before I let you guys go, I stream on Twitch every single Friday from 8 to 12 Eastern. Come hang out and chill with the champ. And also join the angels by hitting the subscribe button below with notifications turned on. I release different FPS content every single week and you don't want to miss it. Champ out.